New at 5 now. This weekend marks the start of the Chinese Lunar New Year, customary for families to gather and eat foods that are believed to bring good luck for the coming year. CBS 2's Lisa Rosner introduces us to two chefs adding a twist to traditional dishes for the year of the rabbit. Tom Lay is firing up the Lunar New Year menu at Chi on 9th Avenue in Hell's Kitchen with a touch of his Beijing roots. His smile says it all, telling us through a translator his favorite part. Making the food for the people that who also have the same feeling, like come here, it's like coming back home. It's a tale of two Toms. He's teamed up with co-owner Tom Lo to bring in the Year of the Water Rabbit with traditional foods from all over China. Every New Year's table has fish, signifying abundance. Here, they make a squirrel fish with a Szechuan garlic sauce. And no, it's not a real squirrel, it's a snapper. It's a fish that's shaped like a squirrel and it's based on how we um, basically debone it. This year, Lei created a dish called the Emperor's Purse. It has shrimp and fruit, and it signifies wealth. We want that everybody has money. We want to have that economy grow. Noodles are for longevity. Making food from scratch for the 15-day festival is how Lo was raised. We would basically all sit around making dumplings, all by hand from scratch. The menu is available until January 29th, but the holiday is still observed even 15 days later, says General Manager Nancy Xiao. We have another celebration called a Yuan Xiao Jie. It's, it means the finish, the end of the new year. And before it all begins, this is an opportunity for people of all backgrounds to cleanse their palates and celebrate life. In Hell's Kitchen, Lisa Rosner, CBS 2 News. You don't have to ask me twice. Some good stuff, right? Very good. Seriously.